Seiler, Associate Principal Oboe of the New York Philharmonic. I also play solo oboe d'amour. My name is Brian Roberts, and I am solo English horn of the New York Philharmonic, and I also play oboe. We just played uh, the aria from St. Matthew's Passion entitled, I Want to Give You My Heart. We just wanted to tell you a little bit about the oboe d'amour. In Bach's time, there were no clarinets. So in order to play at that tessitura, Bach wrote for the oboe d'amour, which is slightly lower than the oboe. This is the oboe d'amour, and it is the middle instrument of the oboe family, uh, both in size and also in register. Over here, we have the oboe, which is in C. This is the oboe d'amour, which is in A. And this is the English horn, which is in F. So Sherry, what does it mean that an oboe d'amour is in A, an oboe is in C, and an English horn is in F? You know there are different links, but when you finger the same note, a C on the oboe, you hear the C in pitch. When you finger a C on the oboe d'amour, you hear an A pitch. And when you finger a C on English horn, you hear an F. We've really been looking forward to St. Matthew's Passion because Bach features oboe solos, oboe duets, English horn duets, oboe d'amour duets, all the above. And we hope that you can join us for our performances on March 23rd, 24th, and 25th.